Hello there, how are you doing? Welcome to my channel. This channel, in this tutorial, I'm gonna be teaching you how to set up tailwind CSS on your Laravel project. So basically, specifically Laravel Live, but I think it works for every version of the Laravel. So what you wanna go ahead and do is um, let me just let me just clean this. Okay, so what you wanna go ahead and do is um, create a new Laravel project. I'm going to sit into my documents. I'm gonna create a new project for ICD documents all right so once i have that i can go ahead and do laravel new i can call this laravel app so l app so basically laravel app for short so i'm going to wait for this to install why this is installed make sure you head over to tncs.com because we are going to be using the documentation like i do say the documentation is the best place to learn all right so what you want to go ahead and do is click on the documentation here I click on framework guides so for more guys you can see laravel is a second click on laravel okay all right so once that has been clicked on let's wait for this to finish up all right all right as you can see our project has been created already so what you want to go ahead and do is cd into the l app all right so you have to be inside the project directory to be able to create the add it during the installation so first one of these is install this using npm so that is to say you have to make sure you have no gs installed in your system or else you need to talk so this npm is going to install tv css post css auto prefix auto prefixer all right so let's get our piece that here and uh yeah let's wait for this to again finish up installing all right so as you can see it has finished installing already so uh let's get and do the npx Tailwind CSS in its P. So it's gonna create a Tailwind config for configuration for us. So yes, yeah, you can see that's created a file Tailwind config.js and post CSS config.js. So what we're gonna now go ahead and do is open this project in Visual Studio Code. Right, because we have to edit our Tailwind config.js. Right, so let's open that up. So in the Tailwind config.js right here, what I do is just I basically copy everything from this page because it has everything rather than just typing it. So so basically we are just telling you that where we are going to be using the css is and the resources where we have our every blade file so after resources any other for other folder that has it as js that has view that has blade.php basically i want you to work in it so we are telling the css we want you to work in that particular place all right and once that's that we have to look, copy this also we'll look for app a app css so basically what i do is also Control P, the search for app CSS, so which is in resources, CSS, app CSS, paste this, save that, then basically, the last thing you have to do is just run the dev. So come here, run the dev. This is going to compile our TV CSS for us. So it is up and running already. And you can go ahead and copy this, and basically, so once you copy that, uh, let's go to the welcome let's add it to the welcome so resources views welcome blade so i'm just gonna copy all this in there paste this all right here save this all right you can see it's auto refreshing and i believe we can create a new anytime that i do php artisan serve all right so we can open this up in visual studio code uh, sorry in our browser from short code and you can see it is working it's working because we specify on the line in this place so let's go ahead and just do some basic stuff so div padding of our text should be white background color green of 500 rounded large and uh, let's do something like text center maybe laravel x the wind css and yep all right so you can see it is working so now you just learned how to use the css in laravel if you like this setup please like and subscribe see you next time peace